Hey guys, we are back playing some more Pokemon trading card game online. And today I made a fairy slash dark type deck, and it's really weird, but it's kind of cool at the same time. Um, basically it features the two, or the two main, I guess, EX Pokemon of the new XY set. So we got, uh, what is it? Yveltal, I don't even know how to say it. Yveltal EX, um, we got two of those guys in here, and we also have the Xerneas, Xerneas? EX, yeah, so, I mean, they're kind of cool, but kind of not at the same time, but, I mean, it's really cool. Okay, basically, um, we got these two guys as the attackers, um, we got two of the, well, I only have two of these guys and one of this guy because that's all I got right now, uh, that's all I got from the pack opening I just did, um, last video or a couple videos ago or whatever, um, uh, but, yeah, it works, it works fine this way, I still have to enter, uh, get, get more, more cards yet. Um, but it, this works for now. Um, but basically, we use this guy because he does 20 damage, um, 20 more damage times the number of heads or energy attached to both active Pokemon. Wow, I can't read. Um, attached to both active Pokemon, so it's like the Mewtwo. So it does a buttload of damage if you can pull your cards, play your cards right. Um, combined with this guy, as often as you like during your turn before you attack him, you may move a fairy energy attached to one of your Pokemon to another one. Um, so that's definitely cool, and along with this one, you get to attach two fairy energies, uh, to your bench Pokemon, um, in a turn. So, I mean, it's really cool. And we have, also have the Keldeo in here because we like to, I'll show you the trainer that I put in here. Uh, this one, the Fairy Garden. Um, each Pokemon that has a fairy energy attached to it has no retreat cost. So, basically... If you need to retreat your Pokemon, say you got poisoned or put to sleep from a Hypnotoxic Laser, you just put the Fairy Energy on Keldeo with the Energy Swap transfer, Fairy Transfer, and then you can just retreat, rush in and retreat for free. So it's pretty nice. It's kind of like the Darkrai thing, except for you don't need a Darkrai. You just need that uh, Stadium card. Okay, well, and then we have a buttload of Trainer cards in here because we can. Um, we have three of the Muscle Band to do 20 more or damage. To power up the uh, Xerneas' Zer attack kind of thing. So we can maybe knock out an EX Pokemon in one hit. Um, combined with the Hypnotoxic Laser, which would do like exactly 170 damage. So if we need to knock out like a, a Genesect or something like that, we could do that. Um, and we have the Dark Patches. We only have two Dark Patches in here to get that energy acceleration going even faster if we want to or need to. We got a Computer Search. Um, kind of debating whether I want to put a dousing machine in here also, but I don't know. We got three max potions because max potions are awesome when you have the fairy transfer thing. You can just take all your energy off your Pokemon and then max potion them and then put them back on. So it's pretty cool. And we got three level balls, or two level balls, three ultra balls, and we got two super rods and then a buttload of supporters. Um, uh, I'm not sure what the standard lineup for supporter cards is with this deck anymore, but, or with this set anymore is, or is at this point. But, Shauna, I put a Shauna in here just because. And we have the Juniper, or the Sycamore, whatever you want to call it. So, um, there's the energy, and without further ado, we'll go into the game. Because we can. And we will be awesome. So, I don't really like this new setup. I mean, it's, it's taking a lot of time to get used to. But, uh, you know what? It works. Um, there we go. Okay, we'll jump right in, hopefully, if people are playing. Um, yes, they are. <laughs> okay, but in the end, I'm going to click Tails, because Tails always wins. And I kind of do want to go first, but I don't at the same time, but I'm just going to do it anyways. Um, so, he does not have any cards, and now he does. So I get to probably draw a card here. I do not like starting with this guy. I just don't. But at least I have the Stadium card in play, so I can retreat him to a different one if I want or need but I do have an N which is nice and yes I would like to draw a card because I have an N anyways okay we're just gonna attach the energy to him and it looks like this guy has a really bad deck here um, but you know what we'll show it off anyways we're gonna put the stadium card down and kinda wanna s just end my hand away here because I want to get dang it I didn't get much but um we will definitely probably you know what I'm just going to go like this um, actually, no, I won't. Uh, I'm going to end my turn, and next turn I can go like that. Uh, <laughs> um, I want to get uh, another, the non-EX, um, 
Xerneas. Xerneas. I don't even know how to say it anymore. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna get the non-EX one out. Oh, and he does actually have a Rayquaza, so I was lying when I said he had a crappy deck. Um, but you know what? That's okay. So we are actually going to get rid of the... You know what? I'm probably just gonna sick more anyways, but... I mean, really, Ultra Ball... You know what? I, I don't know what I want to do. I'm going to get rid of those two energies. There we go. Why not? You know, that was probably stupid, but you know what? Oh, well. Um, we're going to get this guy out because we want to. And then we're probably just going to, you know, get rid of everything else because why not? I want more Pokemon on my bench anyways. So I'm going to try to get the this guy out because he's super strong. This is this is my favorite attacker with this deck, especially since we're going up against a Rayquaza. It's kind of nice just to like, yes, look at all these cards. Okay, so we are going to retreat, actually, into this guy for free because of the stadium card there. And we're going to put the muscle band on just in case. Um, yeah, and then we're just going to use this and take out two fairy energies and put them onto my bench because it's awesome like that. Okay, so we now have four energies in play after two turns, is it? Yeah, two turns. So, uh, basically, he's going to get that stupid Emboar in play now, and attach as many energies as he wants. Dang it, this isn't going to be good. Um, I definitely need to get that little guy in play, that the Fairy Transfer guy, and I will do that with the level ball next turn. I'll get the basic guy out, and then we'll get the other guy out. Jeez, I don't know what I'm talking about. I really need to learn these names, but I don't know them. These are all like Pokemon X and Y like cards, aren't they? Yes, they are. Okay, well, um... Definitely going to attach an energy, probably. Uh, maybe not. Um, you know what? I'm definitely going to play this guy. Get this guy out, because I really want him out. I, I really need him out, actually. So we will just attach an energy. No, 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 no. no. Undo last action. We're going to attach it to this one. And then we're going to use our last... Or not our last one. We still have another one in there. Um... I kind of want to use the Sycamore here, but I don't at the same time. Uh, but I think I'm going to. Not. Not going to. Yes, I will. No, I won't. Um, I don't know. I'm Sycamoring. I'm Sycamoring. Okay, we got the Sycamore. Uh, that was probably stupid, but you know what? I need a new hand. Okay, at this point, um, I'm just going to have my turn. <laughs> okay, well, uh, we did not... We weren't able to use that stupid dark patch because I didn't have a darkness energy in my discard pile, which would have been nice to do, but it didn't happen. So, I want to get rid of this Pikachu, but this Rayquaza is, is looking scary on the bench here. He really is, and I don't have any Pokemon catchers or anything in this deck to uh, do that. I should, probably should put an escape rope or two in this deck, that would be nice. Uh, but, in the end, it probably doesn't really matter. Uh, or does it? I don't know. Okay, we're going to evolve... And we're going to attach the fairy energy to somebody, maybe. Um, actually, I'm going to leave my this guy out and just start attacking with him. Because why not, right? I'm definitely just like, why not, why not just do that, right? I'm going to do that. Okay. I'm probably going to Ultra Ball here, too. And get rid of the, the N. Um, kind of want to keep a Skyla because I, I feel like I've discarded a lot of them and I haven't actually used one yet. So, we'll probably, yeah, just going to get the Keldeo out here. Yeah, that's the best I can do. You know, why not? And then we're just going to N, and, you know, he has a Juniper in his hand anyway, so whatever. Um, we actually do have the Hypnotoxic Laser now, which is kind of not useful at this point, but, you know what, it works. So, um, we actually will just attack here. Um, uh, knock out this Pikachu... Because I, this guy's going to come up and just, like, murder me here. Um, so I don't want him to murder my EX Pokemon, because that would be mad. So that's why I left this guy up here. And he has to discard three energy to uh, knock out this guy anyway. So uh, he actually brings up the Emolga, and I draw a Sycamore, which is not too cool, but you know what? It works. So I have three energy in my discard pile, which will be perfectly for my Super Rod. Um, but yeah... Uh, yeah, that's all I got to say. Um, I do have another Dark Patch in my deck, or maybe it's prized, I don't know.
but he is going to use that mole again. There's the dark patch, so I can definitely get that darkness energy out of my discard pile onto my guy. Nice. And you know what? I can probably just attack again with this guy. <laughs> or I could... Yeah, I think I'm just going to keep attacking with this guy so I don't have to, like, do anything else. You know? You know what I mean? Okay, how many energies do I have in here? I have three. So I'm definitely going to use a super rod. Um, get those things back in there. And you know what? He's probably going to start powering up his other Rayquaza, which is really scary uh, with this deck. Um, so I kind of want to put more energies down, but I don't really at the same time. I think, we are, I think we're going to have enough energies, hopefully. But he won't, because he's a noob. <laughs> okay, we're going to attack again for 100. You know, I usually never use this attack, but I'm just scared of letting him take two prize cards. You know, you know what I mean? Uh, but in case of a Pokemon catcher or something, I probably should, like, disperse these energies out. So I don't, like, lose all my energies. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Yeah, you know what I mean. So, uh, yeah, here comes the big attack. Oh no, he's going to have two Rayquazas powered up because he just got three more energies. Okay. Well, this is going to be an EX KOing party because, you know what? Oh, this is going to be bad. I don't even know how this is going to turn out. This is I feel like this game is going to be almost over because we have two EX powered up down here and he does two. Uh, so, my... This guy won't actually be able to knock... A Rayquaza out in one hit. Um, anyways. So I'm probably going to have to take out this guy. And... Wait, wait, wait. This guy has 170. Cool. So I might actually get a one-hit KO on this guy. Because this guy is doing 160 damage now. And I have the Hypnotoxic Laser. Boom! This guy's coming out. Okay. We got this. X-Blast for the win. Okay, we're going to do this. We're going to do this all the way. Okay. So we're going to laser him first. Get that poison off. And he now is going to get knocked out. Hopefully. Ah, <laughs> uh, man. I need to actually... I really need more energies in place. So I'm definitely going to put this guy down in case I need to get energies for later use. And I probably just should computer search now. Maybe. You know, computer search is kind of pointless at this point. Don't you think? What would I... I'm just going to end... Hopefully. Yeah, see, I got more energies. Good. That's okay. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. So we're actually going to Fairy Transfer. And, you know, this is going to be bad because all my energy are going to be out of play. And, you know what? That's okay, though, because I'm taking two prizes. Okay. One hit knockout with the Hypnotoxic Laser slash Muscle Band slash x Splash Blast. You know, that's the first time I've ever actually done that one hit KO with the with this guy. But you know what? It works. It works. Okay, so um this guy is actually gonna be not looking too good here. So he's I don't know what he's thinking about here. Um bring, bring up the Rayquaza and attack. Uh or do I have to pick a prize? He, no, he has to he has to pick a guy to bring up here first. So um he's probably gonna bring up this guy and attack and knock me out, so in one hit. Um, so I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. We don't, we, we, I guess we just don't know. And this guy actually is weak against electric. So that Pikachu might've been devastating to me if you like evolved it into a Raichu or something like that. Cause Raichu like can do like a hundred damage, right? I don't know. Don't ask me, but this guy's taking forever. What the heck are you doing, sir? What the heck are you doing? So next turn, if he does, what? I was playing a game. Uh, okay, well, um, fine. Be that way. <laughs> um, that's going to be the episode, I guess, then, because I have to actually get going here. I'm, I'm running late to something that I need to be at. I mean, I'm, I'm, I mean, if I keep going, I'd be running late. So, I'm actually run on time. Um, so, be sure to like this video if you like it. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you've not, guys. And thanks for watching, guys. Uh, um... I feel like I screwed that up. Uh, I probably did. But, yeah, we'll see you next episode, guys. Thanks for watching. There we go. We got it right. <gasps>